Good morning, everyone. Today is Saturday, June 29th, 29th. 2019. <laughs> I forgot I'm supposed to say yep. <laughs> That's what I do. We're such I'm going to make a shirt that just says yep. Yup. No, yep. yep. no that'll be your shirt. Oh, mine will be yup. And yours will be yep. <laughs> okay. We're such dorks. Anyway, thanks for joining us today. We really appreciate it. I uh, hope everyone's having a fantastic day. We certainly are. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, last week was a little weird. I was in Fort Wayne doing um, Sweetwater's Gear Fest. Got Stacy nice shirt. I actually got me a shirt too. Yay. Um, yeah, it's nice to be able to go somewhere and buy a shirt to actually fit you. It is. Because wouldn't have happened six months ago. <laughs> exactly. That's for sure. Yeah, and, um, it's, it's really nice to be home though. There's no place like home, I'll tell you. You get your own bed, your own pillow, and you know, your get own back hip. In. Yep, my hand on the hip <laughs> when I'm sleeping. Yeah. So, but uh, yeah, it's good to be back with you guys, and it's good to be back home down here in the basement. And back together. And back together. Yep. <laughs> yep. Partner in crime. Absolutely. But yeah, we are um, we are coming up on our what will next week, which will be July sixth, Saturday, yes. um, will be our seven month uh, of keto. Well, uh, when we were doing every four weeks, we kind of realized after about three or four, maybe into the fifth month, we're getting way off track here because we didn't figure, you know, how to do that. So the easiest way to fix that is the first Saturday of every month, we will do our monthly keto weigh-in. So for seven months will be July 6th, and that'll be next week. So Absolutely. we'll do the BMIs, the measurements, the pictures, all that yucky stuff. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll get there. Yes, we will. And uh, for this week... Um, what is it? The 29th? Yep, June 29th. Uh, we have some new numbers. I've got a little bit of progress on the things that I've been going through. It's a little bit of TMI, but uh, things are moving a little bit better for me, so I'm very fortunate. I think walking around GearFest helped. Uh, you know, I was there two and a half days, and then I went down to Indianapolis, saw my brother play um, in a blues band. That was awesome, too. Uh, had a lot of fun. Uh, for those who maybe had followed back, uh, in history, I had had a DNA test done and um, a lot of new revelations, <laughs> found a new brother that I didn't know, found uh, two new sisters and then uh, another sister too. So, well, I already knew about that <laughs> sister. But yeah, so I've got a new extended family. So uh, I actually drove down to Indy and saw my brother play. That was a lot of fun. Had a, had a blast that night too. And for so, anybody who knows Bill, he hates to drive. So that oh, was, yeah. and he Ten hours so of driving. Long. So yeah. I'm so glad he went. It made my heart very happy to see a picture of him and his brother. Yep. Um, I'll throw one up too. Yeah, so could see. it was pretty cool. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. So um, last week, uh, I weighed in just before I left for Fort Wayne at 337 even. And this week, I weighed in at 335.2. So I'm Yay. down. What is that? Almost two pounds. Yeah, almost two I'll pounds. I'll take that. Yes. I will take a two-pound loss. Absolutely. Yes. I feel like I'm back on track. I'm feeling a lot better. Um, things are moving, so I'm very fortunate and happy. Answer prayers, you know? Yeah. <laughs> so I was, I was saying a couple. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, so last week I was here, and I weighed in at 134.6. <laughs> this week I weighed in at 135.2, so I'm up about a half a pound. However, it's that time of the month, so I'm feeling extra bloaty today. Yeah, you were saying yesterday you felt like <laughs> uh, you saw the even, on the water or yeah, something. Yeah, normally my ring comes right off. I can't even move my rings right now. It's so. a little different for girls, I think, during that, you know, that special <laughs> Shark Week episode. Of week. <laughs> so, you know, you got a lot going on. So The struggle's you know, real. <laughs> two days later, the bloating may go away and you might find yourself right back or if not lower. Absolutely. And, so, and I have to say, last night, well, this morning, I think we went to bed at what, about 1.30 this morning yeah. and I realized, oh, we don't have to take pictures and measurements in the morning. I was so happy. Because normally we would, yeah. But right. we were getting really off track. I mean, yeah. we were to the point where we were at five, week, five months of a week and we were putting up a six month and I'm like, wait, this is getting really weird. So yeah, every Saturday of the month, the first Saturday of every month right. is when we'll call our, you know, the New next month. month. Yeah. So seven months in a week. Absolutely. And we're doing good. Um, still using Card Manager, still tracking. Uh, I've even readjusted Card Manager uh, to my current weight and just making sure that I was keeping things dialed in right. 
I'm just using the basic card manager uh, keto program. Um, the only real variable I put in is the weight and the age and you know things like that. Right. So, but it's pretty simple, pretty straightforward. A couple of people have asked me on that. Um, I got a message and an email as well about how are you and Stacy doing that stuff. So yeah, yeah, it's just just card manager. We don't pay for card manager. We just do the free card manager. So. And I'm listening to an audio book. Um, Dr. Axe. Dr. Axe. Yeah. Um, and what is it? My, uh, the Keto Diet. I think <laughs> he calls it called. My Keto Diet in every third sentence. But. And so My Keto Diet, My Keto Diet Program, it's like it's not your keto diet, it's but keto, whatever. But, okay. but it does have some interesting information. Um, I'm looking forward to, he has, towards the end of the book, I'm not quite there yet, um, but talking about maintenance keto. Oh, yeah, yeah. So um, I'm excited to, you know, listen to a little bit about that. Um, obviously, I've maintained within, you know, a pound or so. Yeah, I think you've kind of found your natural happy yeah. weight. I mean, I always ask her, I always ask Stacey, you know, so what do you think your goal weight is? Because I never want to say a number. But, you know, I think you're you're pretty much right in that 135 range is feeling good for you, right? Yeah, You look fantastic. Good. and Aww. You know, uh the mostly is how do you feel? How do your clothes fit for you? And Feeling pretty good. You know, I'm, I'm thinking, you know, of course, without the clothes on, I'd like to be a little bit smaller. More toned or yeah, something. Yeah, a little yeah. more toned. I mean, I definitely have got I think everybody the, relates uh, to that on keto. Some of the arm thing going. Yeah. But I'm taking the collagen, the hair, nail, and skin yep. pills. They're pretty pink pills. <laughs> oh, yeah. Those are pretty pills. They uh, have I'm a taking those. slight smell to them. They I don't know do. what that is. Uh, they do. They is have it strawberry or something. I don't know what that is. No, um, they're pretty though. They they're look very, like little Easter eggs. <laughs> they are. They're very pretty. Um, but I've been taking those. My nails have been doing fantastic, um, and my I don't feel like my hair is feeling as thin as, thin as, you as it was because I was a little worried about that. I've always had really thick hair, so not being as feeling as thick as it was, um, I don't feel like I'm losing as much either. So that's that's been nice. Uh, skin is still nice and clear, except for something bit me. Yeah, you got, yeah, we got, <laughs> we live in the woods. We live in the boonies here. It's crazy out there. Um, you open the door for five seconds and you have 50 bugs in the house. Yeah. And uh, yeah, we got, something happened. We had the garage door open <laughs> last night or something. And then next thing you know, uh, we're they sitting were in the living room. Feast. Both of us were like, you know, swapping and sweating. We actually have a bug zapper in the house. That's how bad it is. They were biting me in the forehead. In the I went like this last night and I was like, yeah. oh, well, that hurt. So you got bit on the cheek. I got bit like. on the cheek, on the forehead, my shoulders. They really like my shoulders for whatever yeah. reason. They're like, you're oh, well. You're just yummy. <laughs> So we got my weight in and we got your weight in. Yes. And you know, ironically, I see I'm 335.2 two and you're 135.2. So whatever I do, you got to do or whatever you do, I got to no, do. you follow me. Yeah, I follow you. I giggled when I read that. I was like... Just a 200 pound difference. Right. So overall, we are 92.4 pounds down. Uh, we have been higher down. I had yeah. about a month there of some craziness. And yeah. uh, thankfully, you know, um, back on track. Yeah, yeah, thankfully things are going in a more positive direction and things are flowing. <laughs> flowing, not in a good. Flowing. It's Shark Week, so you know, <laughs> you're you're flowing and I'm flowing. You know, we're, we're just we're just flowing. <laughs> we're gel. What else do we got on here? Anything else to share? Um, uh, next week will be that seven seven uh, month, yeah. which will be July sixth, Saturday. Bill's down uh, four, about 47 and a half pounds from we, oh, okay, since total. we started on December 1st. And I'm down 45 pounds since we started on December 1st. So. Yeah, I want to hit 50 and I want to hit a combined 100. I, I think most of that's going to be me though because I think you're kind of there. Yeah, I think, you know, like I, I think another five pounds ish for me. That might take a while because you're might take right a bit, there. Yeah. You're at that, you know. Yeah. But on July 12th, I'm going to do lots of walking. What's July 12th? I'm going to Cedar Point. Oh, yeah. you're gonna. I'm going on the coasters. Your Fitbit's going to go crazy that day. Don't oh. join a challenge with Stacy <laughs> for Fitbit. <laughs> so I work at Costco, and I'm finally back to my own department. But they had me working in the bakery. And I thought I made it through the whole year without having to, to, to buy or eat one of those cherry pies. Do you remember on pie day, I talked about they had cherry and apple pies in the mm -hmm. break room. So I get put back to my regular department on Wednesday and they say, oh, hey, I need you to go to the bakery. I said, okay, no problem. I go to the bakery and I'm topping the cherry pies. 
that is like so that doesn't do anything. For oh me. my! It's no like trigger. My ultimate favorite pie is cherry pie. Mine would be apple. Uh, see, I don't like apple, but the cherry pie. Oh my goodness! Sounded wonderful. Looked wonderful. Smells wonderful. Mm. Um, so I was doing those, and uh, then the croissants. The croissants are really good, but you know those are not that big of a deal. Um, but the cherry pies. <laughs> and then I was doing chocolate chip cookies again. Really. Okay. <laughs> so, but that was super fun. So I'm back. Um, and yesterday I was almost 16,000 steps getting wow. back to my regular department. So I'm hoping, you know, with getting back into the activity yeah, level that see, I used to be, I might be, you might see some numbers coming down again. Yeah. That's the doing, whole are you tracking still? I hadn't, I don't see Stacy a lot. Um, are you tracking still or no? I'm not, but I'm pretty much eating the basics. You, you know, eat the my same almonds and I do eat pretty much you the same thing. You love that things. Caesar salad kit. And it is a great deal. It's like four bucks for the Caesar salad kit from Costco. and I even I snuck get, out the salad of the salad kit. Yeah, he did. And I had a salad last night, so I figured it's good. Refuge. Absolutely. So, good you know, for you. I tend to eat the same basic things. The snacks is I love the almonds and the sharp cheddar cheese. See, I don't think you've ever had a cheese. problem with portion control. No, it's I not. have a problem with portion <laughs> control. If I make six chicken thighs and I eat one or two and I'm still hungry, I'm thinking, well, I can have another <laughs> one or two, but then I got to wait four or five hours, you know, and so it's, I have a portion control problem. I don't. That's why I'm 200 pounds overweight. Mine Or whatever. The sweets. <laughs> Well, no, for me, no, I'm about 100 pounds overweight. I'm, my goal, I would like to be in the bike to 240 range, 240, mm -hmm. 250. And then, you know, play it by ear as I get closer. So kind of what I under, did. under like maybe 90 pound range from mm -hmm. that. So I've still got a while to go, but I'm working on it. You know, didn't gain it all overnight. Right. Probably won't lose it all overnight. <laughs> I'll keep trying. Try. Yeah. So on my way back, I was, uh, we are real near Ann Arbor. We're in Whitmore Lake, a uh, place that nobody knows in Michigan. So it's just outside of Ann Arbor. I drove down to Fort Wayne, did Gear Fest, drove from Fort Wayne down to Indianapolis, saw my brother, had a blast, hung out. Then I drove up to Michigan to Kalamazoo and I visited Keizu Keto, which is Greg and Stacy. Uh, stopped by for a little bit of a afternoon visit i got to ride one of their e-bikes and i am absolutely hooked on that thing oh my gosh i want one so bad <laughs> i've just got to figure out a way to pay for it um and then we had a really really nice lunch the, there's actually a video that they put out when i stopped by we we had made these like half pound burgers with like a can pushed into it so we filled it with like bacon and onion and cheese and cooked that oh my gosh they were so good yeah. Um, then we got to play with drones, and we got to hang out. And Stacy made me a bunch of these little cookies that she makes. I call them crack. That I got none of. I call them crack cookies. She made me a nice baggie, but unfortunately, it was on video because I was. Well, I still had a I still had a couple hour drive from Kalamazoo to Ann Arbor. So you know, of course, I'm in the car, and I'm like, oh, these are like two carbs each, and I'm like, oh, I'll have like six, you know, or whatever, you know, six carbs, a couple of them. And then I got home and I put them in the cabinet and then I was like later. He pulled out two. Hang on. So he pulled, yeah, pulled out two out. and he's sitting on the plate and I was like, what are you What's eating? That? He goes, oh, just a few cookies that Stacy made me. And I was like. And, and wait, let's see, if, let's see if this is accurate. What happened? He did. So I said, I said oh. I said, he goes, you want one? I said, oh, you only have two. That's okay. I had three on the plate, but anyway. And I didn't realize that. And then, um, so on their Sunday vlog, I'm a little late behind and behind watching it. So she's watching. So stuff. we're watching it. And I said, hey, she gave you a whole bag of those Now cookies. you saw the whole bag <laughs> when I left their house, but I was eating them <laughs> in the car. And then I got home and I had some. And then I sat down with the plate with you. And I did offer for know. you. I did offer. I said, you do you want, do you but want he, it? Look, he had I two did. on the plate. But anyway, so they, I didn't want to eat them. They disappeared. I call them crack cookies because that's kind of what they are. <laughs> they keto, were keto we crack them, cookies. <laughs> initially, we had them when Greg came out to visit us. Um, yeah, it was they part were of their samplers. Yeah, they were they sampling were, it, still kind of tweaking that recipe. I so believe. So it was kind of broken up. Good. They were kind of broken up pieces, but we were just tasting it. We were because right. she was still working on the recipe. So um, he said, "Hey, try these. What do you think?" And um, yeah, he was passing through for work. So, so Stacy. I'd like the recipe, please, so yeah, yeah. I can make some for myself. I think maybe they're still working on it, but it might show up on here on uh, 
YouTube. Yep. But uh, yeah, they were really good. They were awesome. So yeah, they're all gone. <laughs> oh well, sorry. I love you. And then Stace gave me um, a Kiss t-shirt too because uh, she was doing um, t-shirt sales at one of the concerts recently. And uh, she said, hey, what size are you nowadays? It's about three. So she grabbed me a 3X Kiss t-shirt. So I'll be wearing that in the future too. Yeah. I always got to have a different shirt on. I got to make a shirt. I got to have a shirt. Something different. I feel like I need a wardrobe department. I my sweet water shirt. The good thing is I can make shirts. So I'll make you a Yup shirt. Yep. I still got to make a Bonsai Keto shirt too. Yup. Yup. <laughs> Maybe on the back I'll put yup. <laughs> Bonsai Keto on the front and on the back. Yup. Yup. Oh, well. I did want to say... Um, I apologize for the briefness of our last you know, week's video. It was yeah. just that we were both out of town. But I did want to stick with the promise. You know, it was Saturday and I, I mentally was ready to do that update in the car even if I had to. And that's it was what kind I of fun doing. doing mine outside. Yeah, yours was very pretty. Yeah. Yours will get more views than mine. No. You, you're so. just a pretty woman. <laughs> oh, that's my favorite movie. Pretty woman. <laughs> She's a hooker. Anyway, she could drive a stick though. That's cool. I'll give her that. Whoop whoop. Right? <laughs> I've watched it too many times, many unfortunately. Times. <laughs> What's the other movie that you watch all the time? Oh, Few Good Men. Oh, I love that movie. Yeah, that's always on. I yeah. like that too. You can't handle the truth. Yeah. I like that. Oh. Before Tom Cruise went crazy. <laughs> oh, we won't get into that one. No, no, we won't go there. All right. Stacy's working on a ramekin. Um, what do you call it? A keto mug cake kind it's of a thing? Chocolate keto mug cake. But she's playing with the recipe. She's tweaking it a little bit differently. And I'm very close. And what else are you? There's some like surprises too, right? To the top, and, or is it inside? I don't even know. But uh, she's every time she makes one, she gives me a little plate and a, a test, like a taste test. And it's been getting better each time. Even Julia was like, oh, mom, I want one, you know? Yeah. So so that's the I'm big trying test. to do it too um, in the microwave because it's a super sweet treat, um, very quick if you do it in the microwave. And then we're trying to also do it in the oven. Um, so in the video, you might do both, huh? Yeah, so I'm trying to tweak the time. Our oven's a little older, so... <laughs> we need a new oven bag. I'm trying to figure out the timing for that. It's still a little wet in the middle in the oven, but I, the microwave... Yeah, we have to raise the rack in the oven, and then we have to turn it up a little bit because our oven is so wrong. We have two thermometers, and the front temperature and the back temperature are different, and it's just crazy. We just yeah. need to replace our oven. It's 22 years old. But that's going to be coming soon. Yeah. So watch for that. And are you going to commit to doing that this week? Yes. So before July 6th on record here? Yes. Okay. So before July 6th, we're going to see a keto mug cake. Yes, I have Or whatever some you call it. I don't know. Keto mug cake. And I have okay. some pretty ram ramekins? Ramekins. 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 Um, from Sweezy is a company that uh, sent us some ramekins that uh, were just a little a step above the normal ramekin, the little white, boring, plain mm -hmm. ramekins. They know Stacy's just full of flair and personality. Oh. <laughs> so, so they actually sent us two sets of ramekins that uh, they thought we would really appreciate. And of course, Stacy's just having a blast. So, yes. yeah. So you'll see those in the video too. Absolutely. Sweet water. Literally, sweet water. <laughs> yeah. There you go. I was thinking sweet treats because you're making. The Absolutely. Meal, fits all the way around. Yeah, that's not an everyday thing, but like when you're going crazy, make yeah. that up. Less than five minutes, right? Yes. Yeah. From so start to finish. Super, super, super tasty. Yes. And then if you can get Stacy and Greg and Casey Keto to put their little crack cookies out yeah. soon. I don't know if they're going to do a video on that or not, but um, those are amazing too. Absolutely. None of them are really food. They're all like a little treat. But sometimes but you, you just that. need that treat to keep you from going crazy. Yep. Dang it. Going crazy. All right. So we're going to wrap things up. Stacey's going to head off to uh, Camus this morning. I have Camus, I have Costco, and then I'm doing tattoos and tonight. And body art tonight, too. Airbrush yes. tattoos at a so it, will, it will be like an 8 a.m. to 11 p.m. night, huh? It will be. That's why I never see her. And then I've got Julia all day, and I've got about four or five projects I have to work on, and some t-shirts and some magnets for the side of a July 4th parade. Oh, my gosh. It's going to be a busy day. Yes. All right, so guys. We will see you. See ya. Thank you for checking in. Bye. Bye. <laughs> what? <laughs> I love you. Have a great day. Okay.